What is going on everybody and today I am here with another random trade challenge here on NBA 2K16. I've done two of these in the past, I think one with the Hornets and one with the Clippers, but I think it would be cool to do one today with the Cavaliers who have a lot of trade pieces on the team or a lot of players with high trade value. And yeah, so if you guys have watched um, these before, it's where I have to go through every player in the trade finder and randomly close my eyes and then land on a trade. And then that's the trade I have to make. And I'm going to do two seasons here. So we're going to be doing this twice. And to start off, I usually do for the lower rated players. I just do all three. I close my eyes and this is an example. And I'm going to land on this trade. And we're trading uh, these three players for Ronnie Price and John Jenkins. So that's how it works. And yeah, so I'm going to be trading LeBron, Kyrie, uh, Kevin Love. So we just made a uh, trade for, I think, these two players. So let's throw these three players on the block. And I can't get anything really. Uh, what if it's just these two players? Richard Jefferson. Alright, so I'm just going to close my eyes and I'm going to open them um, now. And we get Evan Fournier, but I have to give up J.R. Smith. Alright, I'll do that. But now from now on, I only want to do like one for one trades or whatever. But I could throw in picks if I want to like sweeten the deal. So I got to get rid of Mo Williams and Timothy Mozgov. But I'm not sure if LeBron has no trade clause. I actually have to check that. And hopefully he doesn't, but I'm going to open my eyes now. Nick Young. Oh, and I have to give up a first round pick. That's bad. Does LeBron have a no trade clause? Okay, no, he doesn't, but which is good. So I gotta trade CJ Watson? No. I just got CJ Watson. I got all these players. I gotta get rid of Shumpert now. So let's see what I get for Shumpert. And hopefully it's a good player. So I'm gonna close my eyes. I'm gonna open them in three, two, one. Sean Livingston and Festus Azili. That's a nice trade. I'll take that one. And now we have to do, I think. I think I'm just gonna do who's a Channing Fry and like Delta. Uh, we'll just do Channing Fry on its own. This is a quick one. So I'm just going to close my eyes and I'm going to open them now. Anthony Morrow, Nick Collison. I have to give a first round pick. Oh, that's annoying. So uh, we're getting into almost the big ones here. Deladova is like the last small one. And yeah, so he's got some nice trade value. So let's see what we're going to get. Alan Crabb. All right, that's not that bad. Because we might need a small forward if we uh, don't get one back from LeBron, LeBron, Kyrie, or any of these players. So Tristan Thompson is the next one. Come on, give me a good offer. Like, what do I see here? I see Gortat, Noah. All right, I'm seeing a lot of big men. Come on, give me someone good. I'm going to open them in three, two, one. Nikola Pekovic. Oh, I guess I'm clearing up cap space, but that's not any better. That's not good at all. All right, Kevin Love trade. Let's see what we're going to get here. Come on, don't give me Isaiah Cannon. I saw that trade. I'm going to open them in five, four, three, two, one. Thaddeus Young. Okay, that's not that bad. Let's see. I could have got, like, Rubio... Paul Millsap would have been nice. All right. I can live with that, Young. I can live with that, Young. All right, now to the two big ones. Kyrie Irving. Please don't screw me over with this trade right here. Just give me someone good. Like Isaiah Thomas, I'd be happy with. Derek Favors. All right, so I'm going to open them in five, four, three, two, one. Right there. That's my player. Please be good. Are you freaking kidding me? <laughs> Tyson Chandler. And a first round pick for Kyrie Irving. Why would why would they even be dumb enough to offer that? Like, we would never accept that. And I have to do that trade offer. And here's the big one. Can I even get any offers for LeBron? Oh, I can. All right. Every offer should be good. There's only three. So, I'll be going to get Brooke Lopez, a first round pick from Philly, which I think I'd rather want, or Paul Melsop. So, I'm going to close my eyes. It's going to shuffle around. And that is the offer. And it's Brooke Lopez and Brooklyn's first round pick. Or the Celtics first round pick. All right. So, this team got... Incredibly bad. Incredibly bad. And so the thing is, at the end of this year's regular season, I'm going to go through the offseason normally. And then at the start of next year's regular season is when I have to do this again. And hopefully we can maybe get lucky and win the, uh, maybe make a run in the playoffs. But I'll see you guys at the start of the offseason. Or if somehow a miracle happens and we make the playoffs. Season is done and we somehow made the playoffs as the 18th with a losing record. 39 and 43 and that help uh, that made us make the playoffs. Brooke Lopez and I didn't realize before that we have the Nets front court. We have Dad Young and Lopez. Evan Fournier had a nice season same with Pekovic, but none of these players will be here next season most likely. So let's simulate the finals. I uh, or simulate the playoffs. I doubt we're even gonna get past the Raptors. Or I bet win a game. Not gonna pass. There's no way we were getting past them. So let's see who wins the NBA Finals. And it is going to be the Miami Heat. Alright guys, I'm here at the NBA Draft, and I think I'm just going to trade players that 
maybe for cheaper contracts just because none of these players are going to be here next year because i got to trade them all anyway so like this trade i am fine with i don't mind giving up a 2018 first round pick it just cleared a lot of salary so i can maybe sign lebron back in free agency trade him again and hopefully get a bigger value back anybody else that's on a, making a lot of money cj watson nick young uh i would like to trade any cheap deals like jordan making uh rj hunter yes please I will do that. I think I'm going to keep Lopez and uh, Thad Young for now because uh, they have nice trade value. We do have the 16th pick. I'll see you guys at rookie signings or maybe the start of free agency. Guys, I'm here in pretty much free agency. I'm going to offer a deal to Sean Livingston back and that's it. Everybody else like Fournier, Azili, and Crab are testing free agency. So uh lebron is here drummond is here i'm gonna just try to sign the most talent i have or just looking off who's gonna have the highest trade value like white side i know is gonna have a nice trade value so let's offer him a deal drummond's gonna have a lot of trade value so let's offer him a deal let's try to bring lebron back so we can trade him and yeah so i'm just gonna go after a lot of people here and pretty much waste all i think i have like 40 million so i'm gonna be offering very nice deals and generous deals to everybody Evan Fournier, like, he's a restricted free agent anyway. Dirk, uh, he would, I don't think like teams would want him if I'm paying him 18 million a year. Gasol, Howard, I think Hortford wouldn't have bad trade value. Alright, so I think that's about it for now with signings. And let's see, do I get... Wow. Whiteside, Drummond, LeBron, Gordon, and Hortford all accepted other offers. This is going to be rough. <laughs> this is going to be rough. Alright, so... Dwight Howard, you move into my top target now. 25 million a year. Wow, you are getting overpaid. Welcome. Evan Turner. Welcome. Eight, oh my god, 8 million a year. Jesus Christ. Uh, Pau Gasol, 20. Okay. All right, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Joakim Noah, sure, we'll offer you that. Evan Fournier, I'm definitely going to get back. J.R. Smith, oh, probably have two-star trade value. Clarkson, I still have that offer too. And yeah, so do we get anybody? Let's see. All right, we get everybody. So let's bring back ha let's bring in howard bring in clarkson how would that go over the limit if we're i guess i don't have bird rights on him damn it all right so let's bring in him and we can bring in jr all right so that's about everybody now i'll see you guys at the start of the regular season we're gonna have to do this all again all right guys so i'm here we're gonna do all the trades again and hopefully this works out better than last year because us getting uh who was it like tyson chow and a first out pick for Kyrie was just bad so the first trade I'm getting JaVale McGee. All right. You know what? I'm happy with that. JaVale McGee. Welcome to the team. So I got to trade who? RJ Hunter, even Reb, who was my first round pick. And Dante Cunningham, or did I just get him? I don't know. Uh, I think I just got him. No, I didn't just get him. So let's trade him. No one was selected. All right. Let's throw in Jordan Mickey. No one was selected. Okay. So let's just leave it at these two players. RJ Hunter and even Reb. Close my eyes. Come on. Give me someone good. Michael Carter Williams. Okay. I will take that. That is a good solid point guard. Okay. That could maybe get us into the playoffs. Another one is Tavo Cephalosha, right? I keep forgetting who's on this team or who's not. I think Tavo Cephalosha. Johnny O'Brien, no. Dante Cunningham, yes, I think. So let's close my eyes. See what we're going to get. Terry Rozier and Damian Jones, and I have to give up a Boston first round pick. Damn. All right. So, we have to trade who else? Jordan Mickey has to go, and I think that's it. And, yeah, so we'll just do Jordan Mickey by himself. He's got nice, he's got decent trade value, so let's see what we get. Jarrell Martin and Jermichael Green. Ah, uh, that's not really that good. And it's all right. Two players for one is not bad. So, next one is J.R. Smith. And then we have to do Fournier, Young, Howard, and Lopez. So J.R. Smith's going to get me Doug McDermott and Kevin Serafin. Eh, that's all right. Not really anything special. So let's see now. We have Evan Fournier. All right, Evan. Let's see what you can get me. You were really good last year. Sorry that I got to trade you. And I'm going to get Patrick Patterson for you. Really? Ugh. These are rough. These are rough to do. Uh, all right, so final three, Thad Young. Come on, give me a good offer for Thad Young, please. Come on, give me someone good for Thad Young. I'm going to open them in three, two, one. Markeith Williams. Oh, I could have had, like, Noel, Avery Bradley, Kenneth Fareed, Brandon Knight. But instead, I'm walking away with Markeith Morris. Woohoo! And a Wizards first round pick, which, honestly, I'm going to use that to my advantage in a second when I'm trading Dwight Howard 
and that wizard's pick. So, come on, give me someone good for Dwight Howard. Three star trade value. I'm going to open them in three, two, one. Hopefully, that's a good player right there. Please tell me it is. Julius Randle. All right. At, looking at the other offers, I could have had Derrick Rose. Maybe that would have been better, but I'll take the Julius Randle deal. So, the last one is going to be Brooke Lopez, and I'll throw in these two first round picks. So, 11 offers. Hopefully, I can get maybe Kevin Love back. Brandon Ingram. That's the trade I want. Favors and Gobert. Please tell me I'm going to get that trade. I'm going to open them in three, two, one. I landed. Please be it. Mm, Avery Bradley and Marcin Gortat. All right. <laughs> okay. So, let's see what the CPU has the lineup looking like. So, it's Michael Carter-Williams, Avery Bradley, McDermott, Randall Gortat. I'll see you guys at the end of the year, and maybe we'll make a, another miracle and make the playoffs. Uh, yeah. 30 and 52, 15th in the conference. We couldn't do much. So, uh, I'll simulate the finals. We'll see who wins in year two. And I'll uh, probably be the Thunder. Wouldn't be surprised. Oh, okay. The Warriors actually win it. Okay, so that was going to be for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know in the comments what you guys think of these if you want me to continue doing these uh, type of videos. But uh, if you guys didn't like it, just let me know in the comments. Uh, so, yeah, I hope you guys have a great day. And, yeah, so we will give you joy. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.